Today, I'm going to share a little about the Presbyterian Church in my hometown, which is in Meghalaya, which is around 7,000 miles away from Chicago. Meghalaya is one of the states in the northeastern part of India and is one of the three states in India to have a Christian majority with about 75% of the population practices Christianity. The Presbyterian Church of Wales, formerly known as the Calvinistic Methodist Church of Wales, is known for its missionary efforts in northern India and founded the Presbyterian Church in India in 1841. The Presbyterian Church of Wales sent the first missionary to the Khasi Hills in Meghalaya, Reverend Thomas Jones and his wife Annie Thomas as part of the Wales Calvinistic Methodist Foreign Mission. The first missionary, Reverend Thomas Jones, left with his wife, Fosora, which is in Meghalaya, in November 1840. They arrived at Sora, which is one of the rainiest places in Earth, in June 1841. Upon arrival, they received a cold reception from the military and the government officials under the British rules. But Reverend Thomas Jones was not discouraged. Instead, he bent down, devoted heart and soul to do the work which he had been called by God. By God's providence, there was a devout Christian, Lieutenant William Levin, who welcomed Thomas Jones and his wife and give them a shelter in his rooms in the white bungalow at Sora. The kindness of William Levin helped Thomas Jones and his wife feel at home in a foreign land. Reverend Thomas Jones, from the beginning, devoted his time listening attentively the pronunciation of the Khasi words and learned their language. It is said that only in seven to eight months he could converse with people and preach the gospel. He opened three schools at Mausmai, Maumulo, and Sora, and wrote the first reader and the second reader using the Roman script to be taught in these schools. The Kasi language at that time didn't have a script. It was Reverend Thomas Jones who developed a script for the language using the Roman alphabet. He first translated the Lord's Prayer into Kasi and later the Gospel of Matthew and many other, including hymns. For his contribution to the Kasi language, he was regarded as the father of the Kasi alphabets and founder of the Kasi literature. Nearly five years had passed since the coming of the first missionary from Wales, but no one from among the Khasis responded to the preaching of the gospel. It was still the 8th of March, 1846, that the first two Khasis, Uamor and Urujon, were baptized by Reverend William Lewis, who is also one of the missionaries from Wales. This event marked the beginning of the Presbyterian Church at Nongsaulia, Sora, and indeed the Presbyterian Church in the Khasi Jainta Hills of Meghalaya. The Reverend was aided by several other Wales missionary workers and the first two Christians from the Khasi land. The membership of the Presbyterian Church had increased slowly and steadily. In 1847, there were five members. In 1848, there were six members, including one young woman, Kanabon Sawian, who was baptized on the 14th of July, 1848. She was the first woman to become Christian in spite of the threatening and persecution she faced from her family members. The work of the Wells Mission began to spread to the other parts of the Khasi and Jainti Hills and also to the other states of India, including Mizoram, Tripura, Nagaland, the Kachar Plains of the Assam, and the Silhet, which today known as Bangladesh. As of 2018, 
there are around 0.7 million members of the Presbyterian Church in Khasia and Jaintia Hills of Meghalaya.